Yo, what's going on guys? Chris Bonner here, Overtime Athletes. For today's video, I wanted to shoot you a quick five minute hip activation series. Now you can add this before any of your lower body training, you guys who are getting into sprinting or jump training. Um, this is a great activation series to essentially prime your hips for what you're about to perform. Now, you guys have often seen me train my guys with do dynamic warm up where we're doing a series of stretches to get the body loose, increase internal temperature. Well then after that I do a series of hip activation drills that are usually dynamic. I recently went to a workshop where um, it was uh, with Pete Bomarito, who's a coach. I think he's one of the best in the biz. Make sure you check out Bomarito's performance systems. And essentially what he did was a series of isolation. Now I've done isolation hip activation, um, you know, but these are ones that I absolutely love because he added not only a pause component, but a reflex component. So I wanted to just share this with you guys combined with his way of doing the pause and reflex. Um, for the first one, what you're gonna do is you're gonna go down to your knees in a quadruple position. So this one, we're gonna have three different angles. First one is gonna be a bent knee. You're gonna come out to the side. Remember the toe stays to the top of the shoe every single time. You're gonna come out to the side. We're gonna go three with a pause and then three reflex really fast. Then switch other side, same thing. Three with a pause, three really fast. The next one is gonna be leg straight out, toe at the top of the shoe. Again, same thing, three pause, three fluid, three with a reflex. Then we're gonna work more hip extension here where we push the leg straight back. Now from here, my heel is gonna go straight back, tight core. I go ahead and go three with a pause, three with a reflex, and I'll obviously repeat the same thing on the other leg. Then from there, we wanna go ahead and continue to warm up the glutes or activate the glutes. We're gonna come here on a lying position, toe to the top of the shoe. We're gonna come out and go as high as we possibly can, squeezing as we pause at the top. This was the one cue that I took away, the intent of turning on that hip, and then three with a reflex. That's going to work your abductors. Now we're gonna go adductors, and that's going to go here, same thing, toe to the top of the shoe. One, two, three, one, two, three, bang. Then the last one is going to be supine with a bent knee. So we're gonna go here, one, two, three, and then one, two, three. And then the last one that I've never done that I actually liked, I mean, I've done it, but it was one that I picked up from him was just going straight leg, flexing this glute by pushing this calf into the ground, and then increasing the range here, two, three, and then one, two, three. Obviously repeat on the other side and do this for you to be able to activate, kind of prime prep your hips before you start doing your lower body training, your jump training, your sprint training, and it'll uh, start to really help maximize your results if you haven't been doing this. Check you guys next time. Hey guys, thanks so much for watching. If you're interested in becoming a better athlete, whether that be sprinting, jumping, strength, or overall looking like an athlete, go ahead and click the box here on my side and make sure that you subscribe to my videos here so I can keep sending them to you.